hello lovely people welcome back to my channel if you are coming across this channel for the first time my name is Zeni, and to all my returning subscribers i cannot appreciate you guys enough you guys are so wonderful thank you so much for all your support and for those of you who are watching my channel without subscribing what are you guys waiting for please do go ahead and subscribe to my channel it costs nothing and it will really motivate me to bring you guys more news so guys let us quickly jump into today's news bomb explosion rocks the christian universal church international portacot which belongs to the father of the governor of river state governor nyeson wike it was reported that hoodlum sneak into the church premises at number 25 azikiwe street my three job portacot on November 28, 2020, and denoted the explosive which damaged a major part of the church. As at the time of filing this report, there is a heavy security presence at the area which have stopped free movement of cars and people around the area. When our correspondent asked questions around, the people living around the area said they heard the loud explosion between 12 to 1 a.m. on Sunday morning on the 28th November 2020. It was also gathered that the youths living around the area were the ones who captured two of the hoodlums that planted the explosion. As it is always the case, people always have their different opinion when issues like this happen. Some people say that Governor Wike is a very controversial governor, that he is trying to use this to gather sympathy after massacring many people in Oyibo Potakot. Some also we are of the opinion that Governor Wike planned this to keep on pointing accusing fingers at the youth of River State while he continued exhibiting his evil plans against them. There were people who defended Governor Wike, saying that he cannot destroy his own father's property. But others debunked this claim. They said that this is nothing for Governor Wike, as he can easily rebuild what he has destroyed with River State money, which he has been using as he liked. So guys, your constructive criticisms and opinion is highly needed. Do go down to the comment section below and say what you think about this issue. Do you believe that Governor Wike planned this thing as people are claiming? Or do you believe that it was a mere coincidence? Kindly leave your comments on the comment section below. On that note, I will leave you guys until next time when I will bring another interesting news across to you. Do not forget to subscribe, like, and share. Don't forget that this is me, Zeni, thinking out loud. It is Zeni's thoughts.